day of bulls AUA. Quick review, weekly review, wrap up for what we saw with DTM, yep. some of the numbers, and uh, yeah, some of the wins of the week. Six trades come out in February. We still have a few from January running, um, but I'm going to look at just February, what was posted here. And February alone, we've done 127.44% cumulative total just on the trades posted since February 1st. That is awesome. Biggest win, in my opinion, this one made me smile, was, was AI. It launched up to our take profit level seven in two days, under three days, two days and eight hours, which was 96%. 96% in two days and eight hours is just, mm, to, to do a set and forget, um, you know, waiting for entry, setting alarms, putting your allocation in and just setting take profits and stop losses and letting the market do its thing. 96% for the effort put in was amazing to see. Uh, we've had, you know, we, we did have one stop loss um, on a coin, just never really built support, but it was 3.94%. So that did come off of our cumulative total. So right now, you know, with, with the trades that we got and we're sitting on the 10th here today of February, we're an 80% success rate with that one stop loss, bringing us down to 80%. But super exciting. Uh, January, if we do a recap on January, we had zero stop losses to date. We still have a few trades coming in as well. And we're up over 860% for our January numbers with a 100% win rate um, with waiting for support on our trades. And even if you weren't waiting su for support, 85% chance if you just cowboyed in on every trade that you were hitting take profit, which is massive. And we had some big, big percentages last month as well. So 74%, 57%, 62%. And this is all within, this is all within 10 to 12 days looking at our numbers here. So significant wins. Congratulations to the team and all of our members. Amazing to see. So I only laugh there because I'm that cowboy, uh, just <laughs> to be fully transparent, uh, no judgment whatsoever. Uh, there's a lot of opportunity where we look. It was quite the rally. We were talking about Bitcoin having a little bit of a pullback here for, I think, a few weeks now. It's been a while. Um, just a healthy correction, right? So uh, much more to come either way. You know, if Bitcoin goes up or down, we're making good profits at DTM and staying consistent. Our DTM public events channel. This is kind of the center of all the information that we've brought. This is a really cool channel. So it's, it's split up into different topics, different topics or folders. So, so when you enter, you're going to go through the bot just to verify you're human. And then you'll have access to this and we've got start here. So this would probably be a pretty good spot to click on first thing. We've got a video just going through how to navigate and, and that onboarding process. We've got some really valuable clickable links here on the valuable resources to get started right. So before you take a trade setup, it is highly recommended to dive through some of these articles and watch some of the training videos. Just give yourself the best chance of success. Give yourself the base knowledge required to take a trade setup and be successful with it. So we've got blog articles here. And then as we go down, we've got more resources. So we can click on resources. And as you scroll up, you're going to see all these blogs. You're going to see a ton of videos in here. Really everything you need, whether you're day trading, long-term trading, you name it. You've got, you've got some information here. You've got some resources, additional services as well. So outside of under the DTM umbrella, as well as the Bitcoin tap umbrella, we have a range of products for anything you're looking to do within crypto. So you can scroll through here, get some additional information on that. We do have a nice little chat here so we can get together, ask questions, support each other and then contests. So this is this is where the magic is. We posted this on the Medium channel. Just we wanted to give 
everyone the best chance of success that we can possibly give them. So we put out free day trade setups. Uh, you usually got to hop on these calls for those. Uh, we will be putting out more as things progress here. We'll get back on that too. But basically, you know, this is what the trade setups look like when they first come out. So you can see you know, we've got uh, the rules, the coin here. We've got our entry line. Uh, that's a zone. So we put a blue line, but there is a zone there. So uh, as well as the, take, uh, the target points, you know, where typically it's a decent place to look at selling, not financial advice, as well as your stop loss. So this is super important. Uh, we had a pretty good reminder here in the last day or two that stop losses are super important, right? Uh, but we show you how to set your alerts and everything. So we also measure the profit percentage potential as well as the risk to rewards. So uh, I personally don't put in a trade if it's not at least a two or three to one risk to reward and uh, typically have at minimum, you know, three to five with DTM as high as I think the highest was 17. This is how we are compounding and growing. So there is a, you know, video here for setting those trade setups. Uh, the step see the most success you don't have to do this by any means but it is going to make a big difference for you so rebuilding the chart on trade setting the alerting as you go uh avoiding fake outs is a tricky one you learn to trade your train your eye it takes time but that's how we set up the the charts in the first place that's why we say wait for support so if you wait for support your chances of a fake out are almost none Right. So that's where with some of the cowboy moves like I take, you can get faked out a little bit, but proper stop loss strategy. You know, if I get stopped out, I'm typically getting stopped out in profit, you know, at least three, four, five percent to cover fees. And uh, yeah, it's not a big deal. So we teach you how to set up these trades so that they become risk free as soon as possible. Uh, and then don't chase a trade. Let them come to you. So we do take you through step by step. If you've never you before no worries this is very straightforward uh once you've used it a few times it can be a little tough to navigate there's a lot going on but this is where we just really point this out we show you you know what to focus on horizontal ray make it uh nice and big you know if you're looking on mobile some of these images can be a little small and tough to read so um yeah let us know what you think what uh your results are the feedback has been pretty phenomenal so far but uh, we're always looking to improve as well. This is not the end. This is definitely just the beginning. So um, yeah, allocation size, that's an important one too. So for those that aren't familiar uh, with CoinGecko, definitely check it out, coingecko.com. That's where we get this plus minus 2%. So where it says $3,000 slash 300, that's where it's taking $3,000 to push the market up 2% or $300 to push it down uh, 2%. So that changes constantly. It's always fluctuating. But when you find a transition point where all of a sudden it's $300 to push it up 2% and it's $3,000 down, that's an indication that the money is flowing into this coin and it's about to take off. So it takes a little bit of time to get used to, but this is really going to help you balance out your approach and avoid taking losses unnecessarily. So uh, stop losses are a cost of doing business. You know, it's just the way it is. It's better to get stopped out than, you know, some of these coins. Uh, <laughs> I was playing with these tokenized NFTs and there was a point where it crashed 50% in seven minutes yesterday. So you just, you know, that's high risk, high reward. Same coin did 150% in the, basically the same amount of time. But uh, yeah. Stop losses are crucial. This structure, um, learning this stuff, it's only going to help you become better. And uh, the learning never stops. I always continue to learn. I believe Nico has the same principle. But uh, yeah, Steve, always continuing to improve, evolve, and take ourselves to the next level. Students for life, Corey. We students for life. Absolutely. So it's necessary in a in an industry that is ever evolving and has a massive influx of development and and capital coming into it. It's you got to stay on top of things, um, and that's why I love about Bitcoin Tap and DTM is they're very transparent with information, and you've got we've got eyes and people all around the world looking at. 
this information and share it. And that, that's the power of community. And that, that's the power of trading and, and being a part of a community within crypto. It is extremely powerful. It saves, it will save you a ton of time and a ton of stress. This is an ongoing journey. If you are interested in you know, a little bit more one-on-one -on -one time, we've got that coaching available. We've got roadmaps as well. So um, we have expanded quite a bit at Bitcoin Taft, just knowing which products to start with, which ones to evolve and work into, you know, start where you're at. And uh, that's why we put out day trade setups. That's why we put out the, you know, the training the way that we do. It's not about making money for us. It's about you seeing the results that you came here for, right? That's why they're posted on Medium instead of in just the subscribers channel. Of course, we've got additional training in the subscribers channel, but start with where you're at, right? Build that foundation and then you can layer on top of it. Just like building blocks, Lego blocks, you know, you're able to stack and grow and build your little castle that you want to work towards right that little castle can become a very big castle in a very short period of time in crypto but you need foundation you know it's easy to make money in crypto but it's really difficult to keep it right so that proper diversification is going to save you headaches stop losses are going to save you those headaches you know it, it sucks you know eight percent or twelve percent stop loss sucks but compared to looking at your portfolio dwindle by 70% or more and just, you know, a couple months, if you're like, oh, I'll just, I'm a, I'm a long-term holder. Having that balanced approach, you know, a little bit of day trades, have that foundation with the long-term reports, get into some midterm swing. You know, this really is established so you can generate revenue, generate profit, grow your portfolio in any market, regardless of regard international policies, we can innovate faster than they can regulate so that's where living on the bleeding edge living on the cutting edge you know has its benefits it's got some rough patches every once in a while it's just we are fighters here and we will not quit until we and we are, we are busy winning so training education multiple streams of income bitcointaf.com has it all so Yes, for all the new members, please go have a look at the product list. Look at what we're offering. There's, um, like Corey said, there's a starter pack as well. If you want to maybe have a one-on-one -on -one with anyone or we have any questions, please get in touch. We are all about transparency, like uh, Justin also said. So, yeah, Corey, uh, we we tough and we keep on fighting.